we are going to solve a problem in rotational motion a rectangular block placed on a rough plank what minimum acceleration should be given to plank so that block starts topples so here this is the we assume plank for this we have to give a certain acceleration so that it is toppling like that a question is asked right? now assume at this is the center of the block mg force is acting downward direction here when this when we are giving to this plank acceleration a this block opposes the motion of the plank so that on this plank frictional force will be acted in this direction so block exert frictional force on the plank is action for every action equal and opposite reaction will be there so that this plank plank will exert frictional force on the block in opposite direction this direction is there this friction force only will accelerate this block with acceleration a now this friction gives acceleration to this block a as well as it will make this block to rotate also when this block about to topple when this block about to topple what happens is about this point only it will be toppled pull so that this point only will be contact with the plank so through this point only normal reaction will be acting this is only contact because normal reaction is contact force so the contact force normal reaction in this direction will be acting now what we are doing means first uh, first we are considering see here in y direction no motion is there so that net force along y axis should be zero that means net force along y axis means normal direction upward acting mg downward acting so that n minus mg is equal to zero from this we are getting n is equal to mg and the x direction net force along x axis is equal to mass into acceleration in this x direction force is acting frictional force so frictional force is equal to mass into acceleration so these two conditions we got n equal to mg and the friction force equal to ma we got now we are going to take rotational equilibrium we are going to take rotational equilibrium rotational equilibrium take if you take about point o here for, due to friction um, moment of force will be there due to normal direction moment of force will be there due to mg moment of force will not be there because we are taking about this point only we about center only we are taking so that moment of force due to mg is zero about this point if you take rotational equilibrium frictional force gives moment of force is anti clockwise direction normal reaction gives moment of force is clockwise direction this must be equal by taking rotational equilibrium constant net torque is equal to zero for rotational equilibrium now see a distance between normal direction and this center of the block is l by 2 since this side is length l is there and the distance between frictional force and the center of the block is l because this side is 2l is there now we are going to take torque produced by the anti clockwise torque we take as a positive clockwise torque we taken as a negative like that if you consider that means uh, moment of force produced by the frictional force is positive normal direction negative we assume that means moment of force due to frictional force is f into l force into perpendicular distance and the normal direction we are taking n into l by 2 that is equal to zero we are taking now f is f into l is equal to n into l by 2 we are getting now we can cancel this l we can cancel l commonly we can cancel l cancel l we can cancel now see here friction we are going to substitute that is ma and n we are going to substitute frictions here ma n n is mg so this is mg we are substituting here 1 by 2 is there now we are going to cancel again this l uh, m we are going to cancel m we are cancelling after cancelling m we are getting acceleration a as a is equal to g by 2 that means when we are giving minimum acceleration to this plank g by 2 about that at g by 2 it about to topple less than g by 2 if you give means it will not topple greater than g by 2 give it will topple 